We should boycott events in Germany because the German state is forcing the Palestinian people to pay for the historic crimes they committed. They're disproportionately targeting Jewish people who speak out despite their own terrible history of targeting Jews, as well as Palestinian and Muslims in Germany disproportionately, and they're using these events and spaces to do so. If they're weaponizing that space, we've got to boycott that space. What the German state has done is force the Palestinian people to pay for the crimes it committed. Within living memory, the German state attempted to exterminate the entire Jewish population of Europe. And there's obviously a very strong argument that after such a crime of such a scale, that reparations should be made. But those reparations did not come in any way at the expense of the German state. They came at the expense of the Palestinian people who were driven from their homes in 1948 en masse, violently so, and then subjected to decades of horrible occupation, colonization, illegal siege, apartheid. Uh, we could go on. And, you know, that's involved, for example, German arms companies making a packet from selling arms to Israel, including weapons which have been used, of course, to brutally kill innocent Palestinians in large numbers. And this already hideous phenomenon has only intensified because of the specific horrific murderous onslaught against Gaza since 7th of October. And what's happened is Germany has weaponized the space given to the arts, broadly speaking, whether it be writers, performers, artists, of various description. When the International Court of Justice, the highest court on earth, has put Israel on trial for alleged genocide, and Germany's even appointed itself as a state to officially help rebut those claims against Israel. That is perverse. I mean, do they think again atoning for their past means going to the aid of a nation accused of genocide? It is the world turned upside down, and Germany cannot be allowed to keep using its sordid and frankly despicable past in order to keep forcing other people to pay for their crimes, to shield another state accused of genocide from scrutiny of its crimes. Germany specifically is weaponizing its past in the most perverse possible way and refusing to learn lessons from its past. Um, and it has to be forced to pay, pay a price. Otherwise they're gonna keep whitewashing Israel's crimes because of what they did.